it's showtime once again. After you talk to Brynjolf and Skyrim on the Rickman YouTube channel, we are in the second part. I think part. you better listen to Mercer and Brynjolf first. We could talk later. We are in the second part of the Discord quest line. Let me show you the operation. Then you can ask your questions. And now we're going to meet Mercer, which is the current guild master of the Thieves Guild. Oh. Lydia, stop. Okay. It's gonna be nice to get some better armor. Currently rocking leather armor with vampire boots and coldest gloves. Not the best. So I could definitely use some of these good armor. Mercer, this is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. Hello. This better not be another waste of the guild's resources, Brynjolf. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. You break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. What we say, when we say. Do I make myself clear? Yes, I understand. Good, then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Wait a moment. You're not talking about Golden Glow, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. Mercer's right there. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line He's of right work. There. So let him prove it. Golden Glow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Brynjolf will provide you with the details. Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Hmm? Oh, yes. Since Brynjolf assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us, then you're in. Welcome to the Thieves' Guild. Welcome to the family, lad. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin, so don't disappoint me. So how do I get my cut of the spoils? Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, and talk to Tonelia in the flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. Awesome. Tell me about the Golden Glow job. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. They raise the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouth wood elf named Arangoth. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hives and clearing out the safe in the main house. What's the catch? The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Makes sense. Aye. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. What should I do about Arangoth? Maven prefers that Arangoth remains alive. But if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, kill him. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. Alright, so... You watch yourself on that yeah, island. Said Those mercenaries don't take clean. prisoners. He then continued to say... to kill someone. Next messages here. Okay, what I like doing is whenever I start this, just going to these chests, grabbing everything. I think I like breaking these, but it's a nice little amount of arrows and gold. Here's some these, a pair of these guild boots, an extra pair of these guild boots. I shall add an extra pair of these guild gloves as well, and an extra these guild hood right here. Over in this room over here, there's a whole nother set of these gold armor on top of the set that you are given to, that you are given by Tamilia. Tamilia gives you another whole set of these gold armor. That's the hood, the gloves, the boots, the chest piece. Here's these gold boots.
So you made it out. Good for you. Don't expect me to thank you. I still remember what you did to me. What do you want? You caused enough trouble. Yeah, but that's the guy that we freed in the Thalmor Embassy. He was being captured and tortured because they thought he had something to do with or he knew about Esburn. I'm gonna go talk to Amelia, actually. I'm gonna talk to Vex as well. So you're the new recruit, huh? Well, looks like you and I are gonna have to get very well acquainted. Why's that? I'm the fence down here. You come by anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for it. Minus a little slice for the guild, of course. I can also provide a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. For a small fee. Is there anything you don't charge sure. for? Sure. How about I get Dirge to knock you over your head and dump you into the cistern? Look, I've been in this business a long time, and I've seen all types. You can play it tough, or you can play it smart. Whatever. At the end of the day, you'll find that all we care about down here is how much gold you can make us. Understood. Good. Then there isn't much more to say. Here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. Thank you. We don't have any stolen goods currently. This is the face sculptor right here. Before we begin, I want to make two Thanks. things perfect. Before we begin, I want to make two things perfectly clear. One, I'm the best infiltrator this rat hole of a guild's got. So if you think you're here to replace me, you're dead wrong. And two, you follow my lead and do exactly as I say. No questions, no excuses. Then we understand each other. Good. Now, it's time to get your feet wet. And I don't want to waste a lot of time talking about anything but business. Sort of I'm not gonna sugarcoat it for you. We're in a bad way down here. Any idea what? Who knows? Old Delvin thinks it's some kind of curse. I think he's crazy. If you want my opinion, I'd say it's just plain old bad luck. You know, the crazier people think you are, the more truth you're actually saying. You can get out there and start making a name for us again. Make them start fearing us like they did long ago. And while you're at it, make a little bit of coin on the side. Not a bad deal, eh? Okay. Heard you're into trouble. I got him glow. <laughs> yeah, I did. That wood elf's wit. He's a lot smarter than I expected. Can you believe that Fetcher had more than tripled the guard? There must have been eight of them in there. It was like he was daring us to come and get him. Any tips to get me in well, there? there's an old sewer tunnel that dumps into the lake on the northwest side of the island. That's how I slipped in there. Should still be unguarded. I heard you're offering extra work. Actually, I'm gonna do that later. Hey, where do you think you're going? Well, I'm we gonna have work talk to, to Delvin do. for a second. Bring your fight. Let me guess. He just plucked you off the street and dropped you into the thick of things without telling you which way is up. Am I right? I suppose I could use some advice. See. That kind of attitude comes from someone who wants to get rich and stay alive long enough to enjoy it. We're gonna get along nicely. So, if you've got the nerve, I've got plenty of extra jobs 
to help get the guild back on its feet. Back on its feet? Look around you. The flagon, the guild, it's all falling apart. A few decades ago, this place was as busy as the Imperial City. Now, you'd be lucky if you don't trip over a skeever instead. What's that? Look, I know the others think I'm a bit dull for saying stuff like this, but I'm gonna give it to you straight. Something out there is pissed drunk mad at us. I don't know who or what it is, but it's beyond just you and me. We've been cursed. The more truth you speak, the crazier you sound. I'll tell you what we do. We spit in that curse's face and turn things around down here. Put things back the way they were. That's where you come in. I've got plenty of work available that could guide us down the road to recovery. All you need to do is ask, and we can both come out of this smelling like a rose. Sounds good. Hey, this guild needs the coin. Walking away without taking work is not gonna be. Alright, okay, we gotta go to the Mary Fair Farm. No, fuck you. Yeah! 
expecting that, were you? <laughs> 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 I didn't think Maven or Mercer would allow me to get away with this, but I had little choice. Yeah, he knows we're in here for sure. Alright, start talking on Goss. Worthless mercenaries. I didn't think Maven or Mercer would allow me to get away with this, but I had little choice. I just want the key to your safe. I can't. If I do, I may as well cut my own throat. What makes you think I won't? I don't believe you. That's not your way. I'll take it off your... Uh, I forget No! It. I'm not about to let you ruin everything I've worked so hard for. Yeah, that's what I thought. Let's kill me. You're right dead! Once. You come on. Yeah. Yeah. Damn you! My oh. cheese. Oh, Nothing hard to fight. There's the key. Bunch of arrows. Another key. A bow. A dagger. And there's a bee in a jar here. What we got in here? There's something else we can pick up. Yeah, it's right here. But you can pick those little gold, uh, I don't know what you'd call those. Trophies, I guess. Ornaments, whatever. You can pick those up and you can sell them to Delvin in the Ragged Flagon. After this, we are to report to Brynjolf, from what I remember. The Thieves' Guild does not kill as I just walked by. I'm about to walk by more of them in a second. Time to end it. Ah! Okay, I'm about to leave some more. Ah! Ah! Thought they were a mercenary. Ah! Why are you shirtless?
is this safe? No, that's, that's not this, this is the chest. But the black thing beside it is the safe. Like I said, it's a expert lock. I'm gonna take this gold pours, purse. Golden glow bill of sale. 116 septums. I'm pretty sure we get to keep the septums. We just gotta give them the golden glow bill of sale. Arangoth. This document acknowledges the sale of Golden Glow Estate and all property, assets, and materials contained within. Payment of the property has been made in full by Gullamad as an agent on behalf of the buyer. All dealings with the Thieves Guild and Riften is to cease immediately to deter any possible retribution for this act. You are to take immediate steps to protect our assets in any way you see fit. I think you'll find that the Thieves Guild is far more bark than bite. And will likely avoid Golden Glow Estate rather than thin their already dwindling numbers. Good luck, and may this be the start of a long and lucrative partnership. Let's get some kind of a, a symbol. Looks like a dagger through, I don't know, black blob. I'm not a pictureologist or whatever those people would be called. State sewers now, and boom, right here in front of the exit. Now we'll report what we found to bring you off here. that noise no, or the fluctuating amount of people coming in and out of that and pushing that button and doing that and making all that noise nobody knows nobody can. sure we can talk again. you word on the street is golden glow has been hit good job lad yes and here's what was in the safe let me take a look at what you found Arangoth yeah, sold Golden Glow? I got the septum. What's that idiot thinking? He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? Nah, uh, no idea. Last. Well, I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackbriar. She asked for you by name. I thought I did the job like you asked. Uh, no. Nothing like that. You're calling on her for business. What does Maven want from me? That's between you and Maven. And I prefer to keep it that way. Don't worry about it. Maven's business dealings usually involve quite a bit of gold for her people. Speaking of which... <laughs> of course. Your pay. <laughs> You're smart as a whiplot. Keep doing right by us, and there's plenty more where that came from. 300 septums out. We meet live. Alrighty, guys, we're going to start the Dampened Spirits quest in the next video. We are being sent to speak to Maven Blackbriar. Wanted to say something. Who is currently the Jarl of Riften this time in my playthrough. And this is going to be it for this video. So don't forget, pay respects to Lydia. We also a great hero that is now in Sovereign Guard in this video. This is Riglan signing off.